Just as Carroll College closed a chapter on library renovations, they kicked off construction on Nelson Stadium. Carroll College students returned from spring break on Monday to find the newly renovated Corette Library reopened and crews breaking ground on renovations to Nelson Stadium. Spring is when things come up from the ground and blossom and that's what's happening to this campus right now. It's blossoming. Renovations to the library took roughly 11 months. It includes nine new study rooms, a 24-7 study space, more windows and whiteboards, and improved tech support and internet connectivity. The renovations were driven by student feedback. It's important to have study space, but I think it's also important to have space that students want to use and that can accommodate how they want to use it. North of the library, work has begun on improvements to Nelson Stadium, a project that is nearly two decades in the works. These will be the first updates since the stadium was built in 2001. It's real, you know, up until this point, we've been talking about it so long, but to actually see the trucks and the equipment get in there this morning and, and actually uh, move the goalpost with ease. The $5 million project includes synthetic turf, new electrical and stadium lighting, and increased seating. With these changes, Carroll plans to use Nelson Stadium for more sports, including softball, soccer, and some intramural sports. The college also hopes to use the stadium for community events like concerts and graduations. This is going to impact all of Carroll College and the community of Helena. It just doesn't impact one, one entity. The field is expected to be finished before football season begins in August. Both the library and stadium projects were funded through donations. Carroll College hopes to have a formal groundbreaking for Nelson Stadium in April. In Helena, Ali Kaiser, MTN News.